Today, in the simulation center, we're doing a residency internship boot camp. So this is where a group of fourth year students, my fellow classmates, we meet in the simulation center and go through some common scenarios that we'll encounter. I guess it's Mildred Rat. It's right up here on the board there. Miss, Miss Radke, Mildred, can you hear us? The point is really to make us more comfortable with handling some really serious situations, to know what to do first, and just to kind of reinforce a lot of the things that we've been learning throughout our four years here. We did give her five uh, CCs. There was a patient who was developing anaphylaxis. Do you want an IV? Is that what you'd like? She was starting to have difficulty breathing, her blood pressure was dropping, her heart was beating a lot faster, or she was becoming tachycardic. After the patient scenario, we meet with Dr. Lack in the debriefing room and just kind of talk through what went well, what maybe we wish we had done better. Because the nurse was questioning your dose and so you and you second guessed yourself and so you went from the right right answer to the wrong answer, but even the even your wrong answer wasn't you know, wasn't really wrong and you did the right thing and she got better. How concerned would you be for someone? And then it's also a great opportunity for us to ask questions and fill in the gaps in our understanding. She clearly needed it, right? Everybody agreed. Mayo does a really great job of integrating both hands-on experience and experience in the classroom and lecture format. Okay, so one is more concentrated than the other. Does that make sense? The needs of the patient come first is more than just a slogan or a tagline. It's really the way that we're taught how to do medicine.